right on over to meteorologist Kate Bailu with another look at your next weather forecast. Kate, it is chilly. I felt it this morning. I rode my bike to work. What are you crazy? Yes. Oh my goodness. <laughs> he does this all the time. Unless it's raining, you don't want to ride in the rain. In the rain or ice. He yeah. was trying to ride it yesterday, and I was like, on Sunday morning, I was like, you cannot ride it yes. to work on Monday morning. It's going to be pouring down rain, and it was. But at least today, I mean, you got the wind in your face. That's a hey, you're you're braver than I am out there, Howard. I got to say that I'm about to go after the sky deck in about 10 minutes. I'm already dreading it. You need to bundle up outside this morning. Look at this. It's 33 degrees, but look at this wind. It's a west wind, 10 miles per hour. That's not all that strong, but strong enough that it's making 33 feel like 25. And we are the warm spot on the map, at least across parts of the region this morning. It's feeling like 22. Current wind chill in Millville, 22, 21 in Atlantic City. It feels like the teens as you step out the door in the Poconos this morning. So it is a cold, brisk start to the day, and it is going to be a chilly afternoon as well. But as we take a look at clouds and radar, again, our storm from yesterday has long since departed. And we actually have a front that's working its way uh, near the Toronto area through the Great Lakes. Out ahead of that, winds are more southwesterly today. So today is actually not that bad. It's a very seasonable day for the time of year. Temperatures in the mid to upper 40s, right about where we should be. Lots of sun. Again, brisk and chilly. The breeze will make it feel a little cooler, but a southwest wind better than that biting northwest wind that we felt yesterday and that we will feel again, unfortunately, on Thursday. Tonight, 33, mainly clear, seasonably cold. Tomorrow, Pretty much the same as today. Sunny, chilly again, 47, seasonably chilly, we'll call it. But we do have a front that's going to come through tomorrow afternoon, and the breeze is going to be with us both days. So your feels like temperatures today, once again, likely. If we're lucky, it'll feel like 40 at best at the height of the afternoon. And same story tomorrow. It's going to be feeling more like the upper 30s, once again, with a breeze. And the coldest day of the week is actually Thursday, with highs likely in many spots not even getting out of the 30s. But here's the good news. It's dry at least into the weekend. Then Sunday night is when we see our next rain chance. I want to take you into quickly the next system to watch. Saturday is dry. It's mild. That's your better day to be outside. Most of Sunday is dry as well, but it clouds up. And then here we go. Sunday night into Monday morning. Looks like it's going to be another miserable Monday morning commute with areas of rain moving across the region. It does look like all rain as of now, but could get windy as well. So dry and warming up through the weekend, but rain returns into early next week.